it is my absolute pleasure to join you in the opening of this second branch of physiotherapy clinic Fiji in Nandi. Nandi definitely needed uh, more competition and uh, Nandi is now going to offer choice to the consumers. And it's, it's extremely important that we need to nurture such businesses because there's a lot of time, planning, money has gone into uh, such businesses. So if we do not nurture these businesses, then surely uh, if anyone who's going to lose out is the people of Nandi and the people of Western Division. I must say that this clinic is very well located. Uh, can't believe it. The location is so ideal. People from Nandi, also people from Lotoka, can easily find this place and it's quite visible from the roadside. So congratulations, after a lot of hunting, you managed to find the best location. Despite uh, physiotherapy clinic uh, was one of the businesses that suffered and remained closed during the peak pandemic period, the directors of the clinic did not lose hope and remained confident to reset the business. Usha's clinic continued providing that essential service that people need and I must uh, congratulate the directors for having confidence in our economy, for having confidence in themselves and being so bold to open the second clinic in Nandi despite the fact that the COVID is still around us, it's not gone. I must say that uh, they have not only kept their business open in Suva, but have also uh, opened this branch. They have kept uh, the confidence that is needed in our economy. And above all, they have retained all their staff. All the staff were employed. And in fact, she has recruited new staff. And. Uh, uh, in total, there are eight staff looking after Suva office and now the Nandi branch. Usha has also been a sports physio, having the honor to be the team physio for soccer, rugby and athletics in her earlier days. Ladies and gentlemen, over the last two years, we all know health has been the greatest consideration in everything we did. It had to be. We had no option. But when we look at the health sector in its totality, it is easy to overlook many aspects that contribute to the health and well-being of our people. And physiotherapy is one of them. From prevention and rehabilitation of functional disabilities, physiotherapists play a fundamental role in our health care. We have to remember recovery does not necessarily end when a person is discharged from the hospital. There is a critical component of aftercare that can assist a person to walk or lift an arm or rehabilitate from a stroke or even from a fracture. For most of us who have been using the services of physiotherapist can vouch that they play such an important role in our lives. So when we talk about uh, new ways of collaboration, we look at care transformation in various areas to create a healthcare system that is patient-centric. So don't think just visiting a doctor is enough. There are other allied services, or you can say the ancillary services that are around it. Uh, that can uh, actually help uh, the patient to recover. Doctors have done their job and then the other health workers who can take you further uh, for the recovery. Ladies and gentlemen, the opening of this uh, physiotherapy clinic shows business confidence in the Nandi economy. 
It reflects an entrepreneur's willingness to be part of a growing economy and contribute to the local economic development. Such investments have a reticulation effect. From a consumer's perspective, it means a service choice in close proximity. I applaud the efforts of Usha and her very supportive husband Rolf for having the courage and the confidence to venture. MSMEs, they play an, an important role and particularly a pivotal role in our Fijian economy. Nendi urban economy has had a significant growth in the establishment of SM, uh, MSMEs over the years. Most small, medium-sized businesses started in Nendi. And we have unfortunately seen such businesses closing down as well after COVID-19. But with the opening of borders, the economy is under recovery. Now we see some businesses having the faith to start again. And I congratulate such business people who have that level of confidence. The Ministry for Local Government has been working closely uh, with the Nandi Town Council and stakeholders to promote Nandi as a destination for businesses, residential and recreation, apart from being established as a tourism hub of the Pacific. The Town Council continues to receive development applications and we can see a notable level of uh, recent construction works in the Nandi town. Ladies and gentlemen, when COVID-19 crisis started, lockdown reduced revenues for existing firms. Cash flow turned negative for companies that could not cut operating costs. The pandemic also threatened the opportunity for innovation as access to capital and revenue became scarce for business startups. As a result of a number of crucial and decisive actions of the government, we are now in a much better position. With our recovery now on track, Fijians are slowly bouncing back with the confidence that is needed to boost their businesses and the economy as a whole. The Fijian government has invested more than 100 million over the past decades in MSMEs by way of several targeted programs that foster culture of entrepreneurship. The government has provided COVID-19 concessional finance support packages to aid Fijian-owned MSMEs worst affected by the pandemic. These highly targeted loans aim to ease the financial burden on enterprises until we have made our recovery. Some of the initiatives include new financing facility of $200 million. This new initiative will be rolled out by Reserve Bank of Fiji and commercial banks and other financial institutions will be giving out this loan. This will allow MSMEs to borrow funds for their businesses at a maximum rate of 3.99%. For the first two years, the government will pay the interest so there is no burden on the businesses uh, who intend to uh, set up any uh, type of business. MSME can borrow the funds to pay for wages, salaries, rents, utilities. They can purchase stocks or cover any other working capital op or operational needs. Existing micro businesses with a turnover of less than 50000 will be able to take loan of $10,000. And small businesses with an annual turnover of 50,000 to 300,000 will be eligible for a maximum loan funding of 20,000. And any large businesses with a turnover of more than $1.25 million can access loan of up to $100,000. So Stronger Together Job Support Scheme uh, was also established and by virtue of this scheme 
the employers are guaranteed a wage subsidy by the government, which is equivalent to the minimum wage rate of $2.68 an hour when they employ Fijians. And government had already paid out $3 million in this initiative since its inception in November 2020. To date, some 48 employers have participated in the scheme and have created about 1,000 new jobs. Business Assistance Fiji has been set up and the government allocated $250,000 to assist MSMEs in preparation of the cash flows and financial documents needed to access finance. Furthermore, an investment allowance is available for the refurbishment, renovation and extension of an ancillary medical service center. Vet and duty exemptions are offered on a wide range of imported health-related products. Ladies and gentlemen, government believes in giving everyone opportunities to create their own business and become self-sufficient and sustainable. We, wa we would like to see more job creators rather than job seekers. And that's why several um, programs have been rolled out. Because we know that we have a very small market. In this small employment market, it will be extremely hard to employ people who come out of universities. Now to the director, Usha, and her team, congratulations once again. And I'm confident that the opening of this clinic here in Nandi will be well received not only by the people of Nandi, but also for the people in the Western Division. This clinic provides treatment for all types, uh, for all ages and various types uh, of uh, uh, treatment. So if one has a slip disc, cytica, Bell's palsy, arthritis, pediatric care if you need, uh, antenatal and postnatal care, sports and exercise therapy, and many more, you'll know exactly where to go. And I recommend physiotherapy clinic, very much based in Nandi, where we all seated. So ladies and gentlemen, I come to the end of my delivery and I would uh, once again congratulate the couple and the physiotherapist who are seated here and also thank all of you who have joined this couple to give them that confidence that they need. So Vina Kavakalevu and uh, I now have much pleasure in officially opening the physiotherapy Fiji Nandi Clinic. Vinaka. <laughs>